I hope each one of you is doing really well and spending a really great time. Today I'm going to assist you with a very simple, easy and interesting strategy that is going to help you for easily picking the points to trade. Always remember that this video is for entertainment purposes and not a financial advice. I'll be letting you know the very great way and the approach to how to apply very simple combination of indicators and of course I'll let you know how to pick the points to trade and even if you are a beginner you need not to worry about anything because I'll be letting you know everything starting from the basic concepts and lift you to the level where you have learned something. So let's switch towards the implementation of the stuff that we need to analyze today, watch out and of course that might be a very great benefit for us for the coming times in case if we follow that step by step. You see the chart type as lines right now on the trading screen and irrespective of any trading window that you use you can apply the same stuff that I am going to guide you. Now we'll be converting the chart type to candles there I click on the candles now you see that each candle shows you a particular movement in a particular time so this time frame can be changed and is ranging from seconds to even day hours minutes and day so for now for this particular strategy what we require is the time frame to be at 15 seconds there you go now you see that each candle will show you a fluctuation a movement of total 15 seconds all I need to do is I'll be applying some indicators that you need to remember and apply the same way as I'll be letting you know now these include MACD along with stochastic oscillator there you go and two moving averages there you go with that and now you see the four indicators that we required have been implemented which are really simple and easy okay so let's make MACD down there you go okay, now that is more fine for us so I'll be customizing each of these indicators and making them as per the requirement of the approach we need to ad adopt today and always remember there are different strategies different combinations that you need to use at different points of time and that makes you have a very easy way towards a beneficial or rewarding trade do remember that you can reach me out on my contact details for having the updated information regarding different strategies that you need to use at different points of time so now the first moving average is needed to have the point with the type SMA styles of your choice there you go and there I save it similarly the second moving average needs to have the point 14 with the type SMA which is referred to as the simple moving average styles of your choice so there you go with the implementation now all you need to do is you'll be changing the stochastic oscillator and make the percentage k point to with the percentage d point being customized as well and the smoothing point being customized the type sma simple moving average is fine for us styles of your choice there you go with the d point also much more visible and I'll be changing the clear for the clear visibility I have changed the upper and lower limit pixels as well of stochastic oscillator so there I save it now all you need to do is you'll be watching out MACD as well which needs to have the fast point as 12 the slow point and the signal point as 9 styles of your choice you can always change the colors so that you can clearly watch whatever is fluctuating whatever is moving and uh, of course that would be really easily watchable then so there you go 
with all the complete implementation that you needed now you have to watch out how does this stuff can work for you okay now you need to see that as and whenever I just thought to pick a point to trade however it is a very late entry that I did because I'll be letting you know how we should pick the point to trade and at what point of time but anyhow let's see how does this goes for us now you need to remember that as and whenever you see such a switch happening in the MACD bars you see this switch let's make it much clearer for you you see this switch the green bars switching from the lower to the upper region once you see this happening this will help you to understand that you are going to opt for the buy trade on a purchase time of one minute now you will be watching that how does this goes in your favor once uh, it is executed rightly do remember that whenever the MACD lines cross each other as you see here at that point the MACD bars if have switched from the lower to the upper region you see the trade already got executed in reward so the MACD lines the MACD bars giving us a confirmation stochastic oscillator very near to the extreme limits any of the extreme limits and the moving average lines clearly intersecting below the candles for a buy you can opt for the buy trade a higher trade instantly at the point where the MACD bars have switched from the lower to the upper region I was late to enter the trade because I was just applying the stuff for you but do remember there is a condition that do not keep on using one strategy all the times okay you have to have different combinations for different points of time different parts of the day and that is how you can diversify your portfolio because do remember that the market does not behave in a same way all the times so you have to be vigilant regarding this now you see the way i have told you that the 15 second candle and the purchase time of one minute where you have to opt for the trades now you see this happening here the macd bar is switching from the upper to the lower region in case of a sell so at this point the MACD lines also intersected each other stochastic oscillator lines very near to the extreme limits and the moving average lines clearly intersecting above the candles so once you see this happening you are about to have like four confirmations to opt for the sell trade the lower trade the put option that is how you have to opt for the scenarios and watch out the stuff working for you now similarly let's see this now this is a loss no worries why because if you win you also lose sometimes so this is a loss and uh, i guess you must have got the point that the macd bars had switched from the lower to the upper region but then you see that there was another intersection of the moving average lines and the macd bars again switched from the upper to the low region to make a sell so you could have opted for a buy and then a sell so that might be a neutral result no worries that is how you have to watch out the stuff and keep on uh, applying it as you gain the confidence by practicing the stuff that i try to guide you about and do reach me out for coaching collaboration any sort of assistance that you require i'll be there to assist you with all the queries that you come across let's watch out in case if we can have any other point to pick the trade or i need to see off so let's see whatever suits us to pick a point to trade so there you see the switch from the low region to the upper region where the MACD lines also intersected each other 
along with the stochastic oscillator line being at the extreme limits and the moving average lines however were not indicating us the point to pick the trade however i did so because i had three confirmations but um, in case if you have the four confirmations at one time that becomes a very good point to pick the trade now let's see how does this completely goes for us and let's watch out how is this completely executed in the right way as i told you the points how to pick the trade and how to execute them during a purchase time of one minute now let's see that are two attempts that i have placed how does they go towards a complete way out towards a benefit now let's see we are about to have our completion of the time until purchase and that is one minute that we entered for let's see how is this going to be a win for us so there we won the reward and that is how we have to keep on watching the stuff and keep on using it for our benefit that's all for now see you very soon again have a great time take care see you bye respectable viewers i hope you liked the video for more informational stuff stay tuned to the channel i've been into trading since years and i aim to impart all that knowledge in you people other than that for any collaborative ideas or any sort of queries that you want to get resolved you can contact me on my personal details mentioned in the video description